Hello, welcome to my channel. My name is Avilash and I'm a full-time trader by profession. I've started this channel recently where I share my daily market analysis on the stock markets of UK, USA and Canada. I also share my daily analysis on the currency pairs like Euro, USD, USD, Japanese and US dollar, Canadian dollar. So in this video, I'll be analyzing the chart of USD CAD for 11th March 2021. So this analysis is for 11th March only. I'll be coming again or you'll see me tomorrow again with tomorrow's analysis. And please do subscribe to my YouTube channel for regular market analysis. And we can also uh, check the Forex analysis playlist on my channel for the analysis of other kinds of things. So we can see that right now market is trading at 1.2611. And you can see I have marked two lines or I have drawn two lines on the chart and I have also drawn a box here okay and if I zoom out the chart okay if I zoom out the chart you can see that market huh, market was not trending market was going up down up down okay kind of consolidation and after that market had a fall okay market had a fall from 1.2874 level and from there market started falling and ultimately market bounced from here and after this this huge bounce okay or uh, this powerful bounce markets uh, reverse from this point okay so there is no doubt that for uh, this market this is the let me take the pencil out okay so this is the resistance and this is the support okay so if you see that price okay if you see that price huh, starts coming down okay if start price starts coming down and hits this level 1.2479 level then just observe how the price is reacting okay you if you see that price is bouncing back again or if you see some good price rejection from below okay price rejection from below like this okay you can like this a uh, hammer or a uh, big bullish candle uh, like this then you can go ahead and buy right away okay if you spot some price rejection or bounce in this level and on the other hand if you see that market has crossed this support okay cross this support with good volume okay if you see that the selling mm -hmm. sellers are back again they are selling the market okay mm -hmm. and if you see that the price is also being supported by volume then you can short the market here okay but do remember uh because there is a support available here that, so you should be waiting for one hour at least if price crosses okay, if price crosses the level or crosses the support or breaks the support wait for at least one hour okay wait for one hour then you just see how the price is reacting okay let the price huh, let the price stay below the uh, support for at least one hour let the support become the resistance okay then only you should go ahead and execute this sell order here uh, and in case if it bounces from here you can go ahead and buy on the other hand if price goes up Okay, if price goes up and you see that price huh, price is struggling at 1.2744 or if price if you see some good struggle in this range you can short the market again okay you can short the market or if you see that market has made a shooting star kind of a pattern there is a price rejection from above uh, sorry uh, for the drawing <laughs> ugly drawings okay anyways if you see some price rejection from above like this or a big red candle like this you can short the market here okay just try to understand the market psychology understanding the market psychology is the key thing okay. and on the other hand if you see that okay market has market has reached the 1.2744 level this level but market is not struggling and market has successfully huh, successfully crossed the level and market is trading above the level in that case you can go ahead and buy again let the resistance become the support 
wait for one hour at least. Okay, confirmation is very important and the price should get the support of volume. Okay, then only we can consider that it, it's a breakout. Okay, so these are the two important levels, two important levels for US dollar, Canadian dollar. And as long as the market is trading between this price range or between this box, you should stay away from the market. Right now, market is in no trading zone. You can see that there is no, uh, uh, not much movement in the market, no, no clear trend. So it is, uh, so there is no necessity to go ahead and take risk. Uh, as long as market is in no trading zone, okay, just stay away from the market. Okay. So this is a simple analysis for uh, US dollar, Canadian dollar. For 11 March 2021. Hopefully you have understood. And if you liked the video and found the video informative, please give a thumbs up and please do subscribe to my YouTube channel for regular market analysis. And you can also check my forex analysis playlist for the analysis of other currency players. And so bye bye. See you tomorrow. Good luck and do subscribe. Okay, bye bye.